this is a queen bank. I cage my cells and when I need them, whether they're cells still or I prepare it for emergence. So while they're cells, I put them up and they stay warm. They're above an excluder. She's in a three meter. medium hive and a couple of days before they are scheduled to emerge on either side of the rack I put frames of open brood and allow the girls to come up and populate that top with nurse bees. This is a rack of virgin queens. And because the open brood is next to them, they're fed you have to have the open brood there waiting otherwise they won't be fed and you'll end up with a bunch of dead virgins and I don't know what exactly it is that makes them feed them or not because you know inevitably I get one or two that may not be fed and to me that's kind of their natural selection they're choosing to feed one queen over another maybe they sense something you know the bees do know a little bit more about their culture than we do regardless of what we may think. Uh, so after the population comes up and then I slide in a cloak board because I have it on a, a U-shape entrance and this is a little funny because my, my cloak board of course started to bend. We have lots of humidity and lots of rain and you don't want them to go down under and make an entrance there. Anyway, so you slide in the cloak board, essentially making the top queenless, except for the emerging, the emerging queens, virgins. And if you had any, any brood up there prior, you have to make sure there's no existing virgin. A loose virgin will make sure that no virgin is fed except her. So you have to make sure of that. And now I'm just taking some of my queens and putting them in queenless nukes. And this is in lieu of a incubator, like at the house. And so far, I don't use an incubator because I'm far away and I don't see traveling with cells just to shake them up and possibly lose them when I think that the smells of the hive, the vibrations of the hive, and you can, some of them I do have a worker bee in there to help feed them. I just think that it may be a little bit better, although I see people using incubators and emergence at home all the time. But you, you do only have a, sh a short window before they need, they definitely need to be fed, so you either have to cage a worker in there or get them out to the field. This gives me a, a little bit longer window. It's work either way. And that's a queen, a queen bank, a virgin, a nursery, virgin nursery. She's a big girl. I like when they're big virgins. There's a dark one. Half and half. These are pretty.